If I had to describe Kumar Sangakkara in one word, uh, it would be insatiable. Well, Sangakkara down the ground, and he's launched that way over the mid-wicket boundary for six. Kumar Sangakkara, I would say, was one of the finest keeper batsmen that's ever been produced. Cricket stats are pretty phenomenal, aren't they? 12,400 runs, 134 tests for Sri Lanka, an emerging team at that time, a team that was punching well above its weight and punching well above its weight because of the efforts of Sangakkara. Well, that's a great shot. Beautifully played down the ground. He's not a big guy, Sangakkara, but he just relies on his timing. He loved scoring runs. Um, he scored 3,800s, 2,500s in ODIs. Uh, he was a run machine. And uh, of those 38 test hundreds, 11 were of at least 200. Now, only Don Bradman in the whole history of test cricket has scored more test double hundreds than Kumar Sangakkara. When he joined the team, he wasn't very happy with his technique, so he completely remodeled it, taking about two, three years um, to go through that process. But once he got caught on top of it, he, he was absolutely fantastic to watch. Now has he got it? Yes, he has. Sri Lanka, the new champions of the ICC World T20. Well played. They've tried so hard so many times in the finals. This is their day and just watch the celebration, one of the greatest in the game. Kumar Sangakkara finally gets his opportunity under the lights here at Mirpur in Dhaka. For us to, to achieve that for, for us individually, but just for, for Sri Lanka, I think that was a massive thing. Not just for two of us, but that group of players that we were part of uh, for about 10 years, um, who kept you know coming into the finals and not being able to to win that elusive trophy that 2014 was, uh, was very, very sweet. His average is phenomenal and of course his wicket keeping was par excellence. No wonder he was invited to be the president of the MCC, which is a huge honour you know, for a Sri Lankan cricketer at a young age to be invited to be in that position. He's a guy who understands that Cricket gave him a platform, and a platform in a country at a critical point in history, and he didn't keep quiet. He didn't just take what the game gave. He gave more. He used his platform. He spoke well. He continues to be a statesman of the game. Um, we're blessed to have had Kumar Sangakkara as a cricketer in our era.